Hey everyone, hope all is well. It has been a roller coaster for me lately. Wanted to do this quick video. I thought it was important. And uh, I'm going to try and get to my emails hopefully this weekend. Aretha Franklin. So we all, I'm sure, have heard about the will. Here it says, AP News, jury decides the 2014 document found in Aretha Franklin's couch is a valid will. And that's what I want to talk about. Here it says, Aretha Franklin did not leave behind a formal typewritten will when she died five years ago at age 76. The singer reportedly had a net worth of $80 million when she died. But the estate now has assets totaling less than $6 million, according to a report by the BBC. So worth $80 million when she died, now the estate, the assets are worth less than $6 million. And let's not forget, they're still going to court. So, and I'm not an attorney, that's a disclaimer, so I have to say this is for entertainment purposes only. But I think in general, you know, you don't get to get the money until after court, right? When it's been resolved, we've reached a resolution. So the family, this has to get resolved and then they'll get the money. But in the meantime, somebody getting paid. In the meantime, in between time, for the past five years, somebody has been getting paid. I wonder who, the lawyers. If you've got different people, you know, wanting their stake in the will and, you know, uh, getting involved legally, she's got, well, I think, three remaining sons. Then there's the court with referee. I believe they sold the house. They've been sold the house. Again, she's been there for five years. So the family, they haven't gotten their money. It's been, what, is this probate, going to court, all this stuff going on? But somebody been getting paid. The lawyers. How can we get from reportedly had a net worth of 80 million when she died? But the estates now has assets totaling less than six million. Those legal fees add up. The legal fees add up. Typically, as I understand, when you go to court on an issue like this here. Let's get this straight. The legal fees, the attorneys that run up the legal fees, well, I'm, I can't say they run up the legal fees. The attorneys are saying the legal fees are paid first. Family, you get what's less. So, more than likely, of all the decades of entertaining, the singing, the sacrifice, the concerts, all the wealth, it'll be similar, in my opinion, to, to, to Prince. A whole lot of that wealth is going to go to the lawyer man that never wrote a song, never snapped a finger, did a beat on the stage. A lot of that wealth will go to the attorney. More than likely, Peter, Brad, whoever the attorney is. I don't care if it's Samuel Boo, Timbuktu, whoever the attorney is. That's who's getting paid. They're going to get paid first. Those attorney's fees, and then the family gets what's left. Right now, the estate now has assets totaling less than $6 million. But when she died, it had a net worth of $80 million. I heard people, a lot of people are post reparations, but boy, without a lot of black folks in this country, well, a lot of people that are wealthy would not be wealthy at all. They, they, they wouldn't be. Oh, no, no, no. They, they wouldn't be. Because they wouldn't have anybody to go out like, you know, Prince and Aretha Franklin and make, on other entertainers, I'm sure, make all this money. And we don't have a will. Why, why couldn't there have been a will in, in the attorney's office with the family members? See, these are topics that we don't want to discuss. Nobody's going to live forever. Things like this we don't want to discuss. And then when things happen, everybody can make money out for us. Black folks are liquid gold. Even when we are considered rich, they can make money off of us. 
A simple thing. Would it have been so hard? And I know it can lead to conflict to say, okay, guess what? We are going just to sit down and have a family meeting. And it's not like, I mean, we, you know, we kind of, in this case, who knew it was coming. But would it have been so hard just to have a will? The attorney drew up, look over it. We can't find, there's something you we, and then have somebody in the family to know. It would have been easier that way. I'm telling you, one simple meeting, one darn will, but instead, sometimes, and I'm speaking in general, no disrespect to the queen, love her, loved her, but because we don't want to have those conversations, or we don't want folks in our business, well, then we look like some fools, because collectively, we're making everybody else money. Who gets paid? The lawyers always get paid. They always make out. They always make out like a bandit. But situations like this here, that with Prince, what's that do with um, Ariana Grande? What was her boyfriend? I love the way, I love the way. Remember that song? I want to Google it. Hold on. He died. Unfortunately, he had, a um, well, I think it's drugs involved. It was Ariana Grande's uh, boyfriend. Uh, was it, what's his name, Mike or something? I love the way. Miller. Okay, my bad. Miller. Real name was Malcolm McCormick. Found dead, unfortunately, in his home. Well, Malcolm McCormick was in his 20s, I believe. Okay. Um... He had a will. Yeah. I believe it was left. Best I can recall. Let's see. So it says, wow. Okay. So yeah, Malcolm McCormick is a rapper. Net worth estimated to be $6 million. So now he went to his brother, I believe. And mom, I think so. Yeah. He had a will. This right here, what I'm referencing It's, I think it's the BC thing. It's the black folks thing that we still don't understand. Again, a simple meeting, having a will in place. But we're not going to do that. And as a result, I'm guessing, is that how you go from worth $80 million when you died to now less than $6 million? Man, I bet somebody's sitting up on a yacht. And don't forget, different people, different lawyers come in. Then I believe you have the referee for the court. We make other we make other people rich and life and death. All this money could have gone toward us. Just could have had a will. It could have been more money given out to the family members. Could have been, but it's not. Uh, no one has a can have the will in a safety deposit box with her name and somebody else that's trusted in the family. Have the will given to the attorney. In case you don't want to file with the courts, I, I, I don't understand. I do not understand. A simple business matter. Oh, I bet the white men understand. Oh, yeah, it's... it's Whoever the attorneys are, they're getting paid. Don't forget, I'm thinking now, what about the catalog? Hello. What about the catalog? Can somebody tell me? So stop and think. And I've heard this before with older black people. We don't want I don't want them in my business. So I'm so dumb. I'm sorry. And I can't say what her region was, rest in peace. But in general, I, it's so stupid. Well, it's going to get out about your business when they realize you didn't have one and it's in probate. 
that's why I want to hear people, you know, I don't want to hear anything about, I mean, you know, I, I don't in, engage in that. Oh, and I'm just pro-black and, uh-huh, yeah. We don't have pro, I, I'm pro-intelligence, I'm pro-sense. Unbelievable. All this money, the attorneys will get more off of this estate, I, I'm willing to bet you, than her uh, uh, beneficiaries. They'll get more out of the estate. The legal five years has been going on, people. All because didn't have a, a will in place. Five years, somebody been eating off the plate. And it looks like to me they're taking most of the grub. They are taking most of the grub. I don't understand it. I just got some news today, then yesterday, and I'm like, okay, I got a little appointment tomorrow, you know, minor surgery, so I might kind of be out. I don't understand our people, the best and brightest, how you let this mess happen? Where they do this at? I'm having to find myself the whole time to say, you did something super stupid. What did my father say? Some folk, what? When we keep on doing stupid things, I'm inclined to think like my father used to have a little saying when a person does something that's ridiculous, might be too dumb to live. Some folks, we keep on doing this. I don't want to hear no complaints about no white man. What the white man doing? I'm so tired of white man. Look what we're doing. You are following his pockets. Now you hate somebody so much so you say you don't like that man, you know, but you sure making them rich, aren't you? That's what we do as a collective. That's what we do as a collective. I wonder how much the lawyers have gotten this far. And there's more than one attorney. I wonder how much the lawyers have gotten so far off this estate. Nobody's working for free. The lawyers, and this happens in all cases, I don't care who does it. It happens, the lawyers always make out like a bandit. A simple thing, here's a will. Have it typed up, have it filed, have it with the attorney. You can have it in a set the deposit box. Who does this? Really? Well, only my name on it. Get somebody you trust and add their name on it. Sign a little card. Some might be doing f fingerprints. It's one thing missing, and look at all the millions of dollars. Because we can't just get things in order. Know how to make the money in entertainment, but then after that, oh, we kind of get a little stuck. It's embarrassing. It's embarrassing. So, yeah, somebody is getting paid, and the family will get what's left. The family will get what's left. Legal fees just going on and on and on and on. Isn't that something? How smart this is. I don't speak it in general because I don't want to disrespect the queen, especially not in death. But this practice, I see the same thing with Prince. Don't want to handle business. You got the money to have somebody do it for you. Look how much $80 million. You think somebody in the family don't have their light bill? I bet somebody in the family is renting. I doubt everybody has a house. Everybody. And you wonder why they call us liquid gold? Oh, I, I get it. I straight up get it. You wonder why they call us liquid gold? We, I, we, so, I tell you, if we weren't here, boy, a lot of people would be broke. A simple thing as a business meeting, get this in order, and we don't do it, and as a result, millions of dollars funnel to other communities. The men do when they get educated and they handle sports. Now, the entertainers now, do, doing it, we're doing it too. We don't handle business. I don't understand. So all this money, it would have been easier just to have a will, hell, get, find 80 folks in your family, get them all a million dollars. But instead, it goes to the court. Five years, somebody got a hell of a nice income. I, I, I don't know what to say. Our people just, 
I've heard of people say that in my business. I've heard a black queen mom. That's why I told my homegirl at the time, I would just leave her alone because I'm tired of you and this, this mom ignorance. She's sitting up here. They don't want to do a will. They want you to go through probate. It's only you and another sibling. Uh, y'all will, of course, own the house. She, it, it's, it's, it's crazy. She rather let the state get the. It's just it's it's so crazy. That's why I don't I don't do ignorance. That's why when it comes to helping people, I learn sometimes. I've I've had my feel of that. You look up, you be like, uh, so all of this you buy out another. These two incidents, these two folks that caused, huh, eighty thousand dollars down the drain plus your time. Don't deal with them. But this right here, this is some ne. This is some Negro economics. This is some NE, equi- NE economics if I ever heard of. This is some straight up Negro economics. It don't make no sense. The community, and, and, and it's hard on people don't want to hear reparations. First of all, if they would have put reparations, it would be so many more white uh, people, rich and Asians. The money going to go right back to them. But boy, I tell you, we love to hold up the table if everybody else don't. We do a great job of that. I'm like, where is her lawyer? Did he not tell her what to do? Have a will? Where's the freaking trust fund? Where's her lawyer? What 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 good are you? Even little people like myself, they tell you to get a trust fund going. Where is her darn lawyer? Incompetent, are you? What what the, what happened? I I I can't understand it. But see, that's how you can go over five years. <laughs> Net worth $80 million, now to less than $6 million. Ah, because what? We don't want to get a wheel. I don't want, we don't want the folks in our business. But don't forget the other part. When you have assets, don't forget the other part. But you sure as hell don't mind. Since black folks now, a lot of them want to be so pro-black. I don't consider my pro-black. I'm pro-sense. I'm pro-intelligent people. Because I, 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 I see through that little game. Having assets, a power of attorney, anybody got anything. A trust. This kind of money should have been a trust. But I know sometimes our people, we don't want to hear about this. So we can make the money, but we don't want to hear about all of that. But I don't want you in my business. I was telling somebody years ago about investing. You trying to steal my money, Negro, please. And I'm your ride home. You didn't even have a car. I'm like, but you coming into this, my wife, I do this right here. The ignorance is astounding. Again, stop and think. The lawyers will get more money than her heirs. I believe she has a special needs son. The lawyers will get more money than her son. Than her sons. I think, is it, is it three of them left? Three, she has, she has three sons, I believe. Survivors. The lawyers will get more money than them. Why? Lack of a darn will. <laughs> They'll be sitting there. They can buy a yacht. With the money that's left over, pants and bills might be on that little tugboat. Might try to try to get a chair and put some kind of <laughs> floating device underneath, like the folks try to get here to the country. Maybe you're like, "Wow, what kind of contraption is that?" But they on a yacht. Hi, bye. Why? Oh, your loved one didn't have a will. Nobody handled business. So, but thank you so much. Those years of working so hard, entertainment and singing. Oh my gosh, it's paid off for Peter. I ain't getting mad at him. I've heard young people try to talk to older people in the family, black people, same thing. Oh, what you in my business? <laughs> well, the white man gonna be all up in it and he's gonna get paid. So miss me with your so-called fake pro-blackness, fake I love my family. We have to get an understanding. This group got 90% of the 90% of the new unemployment claims by black folks. Mm, you think? Are we surprised? How many are gonna have somebody in the family? I don't care if it's a house, regular house, be sitting up, don't have any paperwork, no power of attorney, no will, no nothing. When it changes hand, just move in. Then when the catastrophe happens or something goes on, oh, we've been paying insurance to the mom or the grandmama name. She's deceased. Insurance company finds out. We got to get a whole new policy. Who do we talk to? Well, so-and-so staying there now. You have any paperwork? No, that was her favorite. 
Life is business, and we, we refuse to inculcate and digest the message, understand it, act accordingly, and that's why we're failing at it. So this here, whoo, whoever those lawyers are, whoa, I wish I was a lawyer be on that payroll, the referee. Getting paid mighty, mighty handsomely. Listen, let me know what you all think. Feel free to comment, like, subscribe, and share. This is disappointing, and it's just... Uh, to me, as a black person, it's kind of embarrassing. Oh, don't forget, by the way, the world is watching, and I'm out.